Solitude's an interesting idea. It all has to do with what you're processing. Solitude is freedom from input from other minds. So if you're processing something that was generated from another mind, you're not in a state of solitude. Our brain takes very seriously the idea that, okay, this input we're getting right now came from another human being. So it has nothing to do with physical isolation. It's crucial for humans to have solitude on a regular basis. It takes a lot of power for our brain to, okay, all hands on deck. There's another human mind that we're processing right now. So if you're always doing that, the brain doesn't get down cycles. So you're gonna get anxiety and other types of issues. It's also crucial for self-development and insight generation. If our brain is in processing mode, it can't actually be making sense in any sort of significant degree of the information that it's processing. So to get solitude in your life is as easy as just some of the places where you used to have it, even when you're really busy, you get it back by just not using your phone. On my commute today, I'm not gonna put on the podcast for the first 20 minutes or when I'm walking a dog I'm not putting in the earbuds so it's stuff that you're already doing just do some of those things without the slot machine and the constant access to solitude busting information